In order to upload anything to YouTube, the first thing you need to have is a Google account of some type. If you have a Gmail account or something, then that's really all you need. If you're not sure, all you have to do is just go to google.com and up top here, you'll notice if you're signed in or not. If you're not signed in, um, this is where you go ahead and sign in if you have a Gmail account or something like that. If not, you can create a new account. But here's a way to test it. Simply just go down here, or actually just go up here where you see these little squares. Okay, that's actually a menu, believe it or not. And then click on the YouTube button. Okay, now if you're logged in, you're going to have the ability to go to your YouTube channel. Okay, uh, but if not, then it's going to ask you to sign in. So if I got to go sign in, whether you have an account or not, just click on sign in. Now I already have some accounts, so I'm going to go ahead and log in with mine. Okay, if you do not have any type of Google account, <clears throat> you're going to need to create one, and it's going to ask you to do so. Okay, now that's how you simply do get your uh, to your Google account, or excuse me, to your YouTube account. Now, if you wish to see your channel, uh, I can go over here to, you'll see a little menu over here next to the YouTube icon. Okay, and these little dashes represent a menu. You click on that and then you'll see that. Now you'll see my channel, my subscriptions, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So if you click on my channel, it'll probably ask you to set up a channel if you don't have one yet. You don't have to worry about all the settings. Just go and click on that. Now once you're in here, you'll see if you have any other videos installed, things like that. Okay. But this is where your videos are going to go when you upload them from your phone uh, or from your camera. Now, the next step I'm going to show you is how to get the app on your phone and upload your videos from there. Okay, now I want to talk about how to get video from your phone. Let's say you're using your cell phone to do a recording, whether it's an iPhone or in my case, it's an Android, uh, Samsung. Um, it, it really doesn't matter what you're using. The application process is pretty much the same. So in this case, I'm using uh, an Android. So what I want to first do is I want to get the app called the YouTube app. Okay. Now, if you're not sure how to get that, somewhere on your phone already, you have something that is a button that tells you how to get apps. Okay. Um, in this case, it's if it's an iPhone, it's probably the iPhone store. Okay, and if it's an Android, you have what's called the Play Store. Okay, so I click on Play Store, and then from there, I'm going to simply do a search once it opens. I'm sorry about the quality here. I haven't found anything that will allow me to view the video directly onto the screen here to make this better, but so bear with me a second here. Okay, so once you're in there, what you can do now is just simply do a search. So click on the little spyglass up there, the magnifying glass, and do a search for YouTube. Okay, and search. Like I said, if you're using an iPhone uh, or an iPad or something like that, the, the process here is pretty much the same. Now, you're going to see uh, pretty much something here that just simply says YouTube. It's by Google. Uh, and if you notice on my screen, you may not see that there, but it says it's already installed. If not, uh, it'll probably just say free. Okay, so you click on it. Uh, so, for example, if, I wanted, if this were it and I wanted to get it, now I click on it and it says install. You simply install and it will download it onto your phone and it'll tell you when it's ready. Okay. So I already have this app on my phone. So now um, I have a little icon. And if you don't see the icon on your screen, like I have here, you may need to go find it. So now I have um, a button down here called apps. I click on that. And then from there, it shows me the applications that I already have on my phone. However, that doesn't necessarily mean that the one you downloaded went there. 
Okay. Um, so all you have to do is you might see an arrow up here that shows a download arrow. Okay. Where my finger is here. So click on that and that will show you the um, applications that you've downloaded. Okay. So from there, you can go and click on that YouTube application and get it there. Okay, so what I did is I clicked it and I saved it here. So now I want to take my video and upload it to my YouTube account that I already have uh, created earlier. So I'm going to click on the YouTube button. And from there, it's just going to open up. It's going to ask you most likely to sign into YouTube if you haven't. Uh, but you'll notice, and this is kind of difficult to see, but over next to the YouTube icon where my finger is pointing here, okay, you'll see three little lines on the left side of the screen. So if I click on that, that's actually a menu. So that menu is going to open up. And from there, this is where you'll be able to log into your, your YouTube account using your email address and your password that you created. Okay, so from there, um, I can go and see whatever. But bottom line is, as long as I'm logged into YouTube, that's all that matters at this point in time. Now, uh, I can close this menu. Now, if I decide I want to upload something, actually, I got to go back in there. I want to up, click, go and click on the Uploads button. And this is how we're going to take a video and upload it to YouTube. Now, here's a video that I've taken that I wanted to upload for my dog, and it's still in the process of uploading. It does take a while. It might take 15, 20 minutes, or a half an hour, depending on how big your video is and what quality it is. So if I want to get a video to upload, I'm going to click on that Upload button there, and I'm going to go find a video. And uh, let's just say I take that one. That's the one I just recorded. From there, it's going to ask you, give it a title. So when you want to give your video a descriptive title, I suggest the service you're doing and where you're doing it. Okay, give it a description. In the description field, I would suggest putting in your website address and your business name, address, and phone number. Okay, by the way, if it's too hard to do it on your phone, you could always log into YouTube and do it later after you've uploaded it. Okay, as far as privacy, if you want it to be public, obviously make sure you mark it as public. Uh, otherwise, nobody's going to be able to view it. Okay. And uh, tags, you don't have to worry about that right now. Okay. So once you have your video and you have that stuff filled in, or at least a title minimum, okay, and your privacy public, then click on that arrow that says upload. Now, I don't want to upload this one right now. But uh, once you do, it's going to start showing a progress bar just like you see here. And then from there, all you have to do is go back to your YouTube account and you can get the link for that.